Welcome back. We will, well, we will be talking about the FNO space in just a bit. As of now, let's get talking about the technicals. We have a good market on our hands. We have the Nifty, which is above 18,000 and sustain, sustaining at those levels, and the mid cap index, which is up over 200 odd points. Manish Hathiramani of Deen Dayal Investments joins in now to discuss what he's tracking today. Manish, well, we are closing in on the week. What's your recommendation on uh, specific stocks as well as the index? Good afternoon to you and to all our viewers. Well, I do notice that, yes, we are trading above the 200 DMA. Things seem to be looking good. But 18,150, 18,160 really are the resistance points to look out for. And if you notice, we are resisting over there since the morning. Therefore, until we don't really get past, let's say, a round figure of 18,155 to be precise, I would not really be excited to go long. However, if we do cross that, I feel 18,300 should be the next target. Coming to my stock-specific action, I'm working with two buy calls. My first is on Kotak Bank for a target of 1850, stop loss of 1750. We've had a good consolidation phase between 1750 and 1780, and thereafter we have broken out on above average volumes. The second buy is on an Infosys for a target of 1650, stop loss 1575. The tech space seems to see some breakouts across the board, like Tech Mahindra and TCS. After crossing 1590, Infi has broken out of its short-term range and we should be headed higher. Uh, you know, just uh, to add to what Manish has said, 18155 is uh, the technical mark, is, the, is what he said as a resistance. Uh, if you corroborate that with the FNO data, 18150 call has seen a fair amount of writing. The premium is 5 rupees. So those who are writing that don't believe that the market could go beyond that 181556 mm -hmm. or 155 mark as well. And were there to, uh, you know, be a move above that, then these guys will have to cover their positions and which would lead the markets uh, much higher. So that's about uh, the FNO pack uh, part of the things. Okay, I just had a couple of more chart checks for Manish, if we could get them on board. Manish, you know, from the nifty companies, a lot of these stocks are hitting fresh highs. Uh, so as we speak, um, m, m is at a fresh high. It's now up about 10% for the year already. It's almost at that 1400 rupee mark. And the market cap of m, &M is almost approaching 2 lakh crores now. Uh, do you see more upsides technically on this stock and anything else in the auto space that you like? So m, &M is actually, uh, we had this resistance level of about 1391, which was the intermediate high that was created on 3rd of February. We have crossed that with just a trickle this morning. If we can keep above that, let's say 1395 round it up, 1430, 1440 should be the next target. All right, take that point, uh, Manish. Thanks a lot for that. In fact, uh, now we do have uh, some of the plates, uh, our directors uh, pulled up for the option side. 18,150 call is the one that I was talking about. Uh, continues to see a fair amount of writing. And for a premium of 7 odd rupees, it's telling you that uh, the bears believe that 18,150 upwards could perhaps face some sort of resistance. But if that does get taken out, there could be a case for a lot more short covering. On the way down, however, you know, uh, the region where we are at right now, 18,070, 18,075, is seeing a fair amount of support. And that's because of the 18,100 put writers. Uh, almost a crore shares added in open interest for a premium of 40 odd rupees. So the bulls believe that 18,060 to 18,070 would be important supports to watch out for. All of these will be extremely crucial post 3 p.m. because that's when the weekly options expiry trade will play out. Okay, all right, Manglam, that's on the FNO space. We need to take a short break now, but uh, we have a lot more to track in terms of what is a very exciting market at this point, at least in terms of the broader markets, a lot of stocks buzzing around. More on that once we're back, stay tuned.